give you a little quick video here on uh, what you get when you order a jet kit from Six Sigma. I ordered a kit for my 82 Kawasaki KZ550. Um, I ordered the Stage 3 kit. You get the Stage 3 if you've got the uh, pod filters and like a 4 in one done any type of exhaust work, stuff like that. Alright, it comes with instructions on how to install the jet kit. Um, it comes with carburetor cleaning instructions. And I think there is a, yeah, a thing here on how to build your own synchronizing uh, gauge. Uh, get a sticker, there's an ad for a nitrous oxide kit, you know. Nice, that's really good. Alright, now. Trying to do this one handed here. But inside the really important stuff here, with this kit, it comes with uh, four 100 jets. You get. Oh, wait, there's actually five in there. Huh. Okay. There's no notice that. And then four 105 main jets. It says to put the 100s in first. If it's still too lean, put the 105s in. Simple enough. You get four um, number 38 pilot jets. They're supposed to be a little bit longer. It says to pick up more fuel out of the fuel bowl. Uh, you get some washers and spacers to adjust your needle. It sits down into the slide and you get a drill bit and this big wood screw that's basically what it is but that's for um, on some of those bikes uh, from the factory they put plugs over the uh, idle screws the idle fuel mixture screws and so you got to remove those plugs to adjust the idle fuel mixture screws so it's uh, drill it out a little hole in there and then take that screw and it runs it under and pops the plug out so if you're so I wouldn't I didn't really know exactly what all come with the kit from them and couldn't really find any information I know there wasn't no videos on it so I decided I'd make one myself um, so if you're wondering what all exactly comes in a Six Sigma kit that's it it's uh, like I said uh, two different types of mains the pilot, the shims for your needle, and then the drill bit and screw to remove the uh, caps for the fuel, the uh, idle fuel mixture screws. All right, guys, um, I'm gonna put this on sometime and see how the bike runs in. So thanks for watching. Uh, sure to like, share, and subscribe, all that good stuff. All right, see you guys.